Hey guys, Rusty here. So today what we're going to do is we're actually going to go over badge service, why it's so important, and how we're going to award the badge to the players actually. Now this is something that's really important. Say like you have made just a really difficult obby or something and you wanted to give the player a badge to reward themselves with finishing it so that they can go and show their friends or whatever. And it can also encourage people to finish your game all the way instead of leaving halfway through. Your attack is cheap. Show me the code. Okay, okay, anyways, let's go ahead and add in a block right here. I'm just going to scale this out a little bit, something like this. I'm going to make it a nice, fun color. Let's make it yellow, actually. Just going to move it over here. Now we're going to go ahead and add in a script to this. But before we actually do anything in the script, we're going to go ahead and click on the Home tab, go to Game Settings, and then go down to Monetization. And so here you should see a badges thing. Go ahead and click on create badge. So now that you're here, you should open up Roblox's website. I'm going to ask for your image. So you're going to want a badge image. You can go ahead and grab any image off your computer or any image that you have made or downloaded. Alrighty, I have my little llama face PNG loaded up here. I'm just going to name the, pit, the badge uh, congratulations. Let's go ahead and do that, and then we need a description for this badge, so this description for this badge, we're going to go ahead and say, Congratulations, you have beat my hobby. Something cringy like that, and then we can go ahead and click preview. Now, you get a certain amount of badges for free, and then after that, that's when Roblox will start actually ch uh, charging you for badges. I believe it starts getting 50 Robux a badge after the, your first five badges. So the first five are always free. Go ahead and just click on purchase and that'll be good. Now if you just go back over to Roblox Studio. All right, back inside of Roblox Studio, you should see something like this. If you don't, you can go ahead and click on the refresh button right here. That'll refresh it. As you can see, we have our badge uh, name, uh, image, and description right here. You can go ahead and click on the three dots to the right of the description and copy the ID to clipboard. Now we can exit out of the game settings. And now we need to make a function so when our part gets touched, we can go ahead and award the badge to the player. So we're gonna say script.parent.touch. We're gonna connect a function to that. This function is gonna take the parameter of hit. Now we're gonna go ahead and get our player variable. So we're gonna say local player will be equal to game dot players get player from characters. So we hit dot parent. And we're gonna check to see if it's a player. Then we're gonna go ahead and say game get service this will be our badge service and we're going to tell it to award badge and then we're going to get our player and our badge id just like that so now basically what's happening here is this part of the script it's setting up our function and variable of the player this is checking to make sure it is our player and if it is our player that it's going to get the badge service from the game it's going to award our badge to the actual player so we can go ahead and test it make sure parts anchored and let's click on play here. Now when you click on your part, Grr, why don't you stinking work? Alright, there is one mistake on my end. I forgot that we need to go ahead and say player.userid. So this will get the player's user actually and award the badge to their user. Not the actual player themselves, but they'll still get the badge. Now when you go ahead and click it, you'll see a badge in the bottom right. That we get the badge. Everyone's happy. Goodbye. Make sure to subscribe and comment down below your suggestions and ideas. I make sure to get back to every single one of them.